Donna for sure is the cook. Barbecued um, steak, uh, corn on the cob, asparagus, mushroom, and oh, watermelon we had. I just ate, I just opened this up here. Oh, sick. <laughs> So we are stuffed. Did, 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 did. Hello, everybody. We've been really busy. We've been really busy this week, even though we're pat, we're we're in the second week past Canathon. We've been well. Last week was busy shipping. Oh, this week we're we're doing some construction in Kitty City. So. We've been busy. Yeah. I don't think I can move. And my mom joined us. Mudgy is ready. What's the matter? Oh, and then after we do boxes, I have probably like 50, no, 20, 20 envelopes. And it's, I just want to let people know, come here, like baby. your, come here. your, come here. uh, things. I think some of those are from Catathon. I don't know how we got there. I know that. Oh, <laughs> uh, well, actually, no, LJ. That's also in my house. My mom did eat. She ate some steak and... Um, mushroom and asparagus. She is so beautiful. Thank you, Iper. So, I gotta get moving. <laughs> so, are you ready, Mudgy? You're ready, I'm ready. Mudgy says she is, and Zelda's ready. Um, yeah. So, and you see who's here also. You all know Donna's here. From Tennessee. <laughs> hi, Yankee. Hi, everybody. Nice to see you all on there. And then Anne is here, who is Pen and Teller and Pixel's mama. She came from Philadelphia. And you're saying till Sunday. Sunday. Till Sunday. So that's cool. Got two visitors right now. Have somebody else coming Saturday, I think it is. Oh, and somebody. There's another visitor coming in too. So pretty neat. I, I tried some I of that. I think Barb just better. Give you a quickie update. Oh, Pen, I uh, Ann showed me some pictures of Pen and Teller and Pex, Pixel. And, oh my gosh, they're, they're just the handsomest things. I showed them that. Did you show them? Yeah. Um, Bonnie is doing so much better. It's been. But 48 hours now that she's had any seizures, um, she's still not 100%, but she's doing so much better. Monday, I was very, very worried about her. She had minimum 20 seizures, probably. It was really a bad day, but as bad a day as what Monday was for her, Tuesday really was a big improvement, and today's even better yet. And actually, you know, she... Um, she spent the night out here last night, and she did good. So we're just going to keep plodding along. She's not on any medicine. Um, her respirations and her uh, pulse, her heart rate is good now, uh, but it's it's kind of left her a little foggy. But she's she's coming she's coming out of that fog. So that's what we're working on. Yeah. Hey, hi, Marmy too. Hi, good to see you there. All right, so this is from Ann. There's two things in there. One is from Cindy. Oh, okay. One is from Ann and one is from Cindy. Oh. Oh, oh. I really wanted to get one of them out for Catathon, that one, but I didn't oh. make it. And it lights up. 
It lights. Oh, it yeah, does it light up. Um, I was going to try to get it out for the basket, the cat for human basket, but yeah. I didn't know it should be fine. Oh, and it does light up. And now is this is this for um, whatever you want to do? Okay, a flash, a raffle, mm -hmm. or something. Whatever you okay. want to do. So, Mudgy, a flash, a raffle. So we'll get this we'll get this going. Isn't that cute? Did you and you made this uh -huh. one? Yeah. Cute. I love how you did the white paws. Yeah. <laughs> and the eyes. That's really cute, Anne. Okay. There you go. And. And what, so it's the face and the back. Oh, and the yeah, back thing is where we stick yep. that in. Mm -hmm. And then this is from your friend. Yep. Cindy. Cindy. This is from friend Cindy from Pennsylvania. Oh. Is it glazy? It's glazed. Glaze. I used yeah. to do this. Is, oh, and it's a thing. Yeah. Oh, my gosh. She did a beautiful job on that. Yeah. Can you see the glazing on it? It's beautiful. Oh, Faithy bits 25 already. <laughs> <laughs> oh, wow. That is really beautiful. I used to do ceramics, and I like doing the, the, glaze. the glazing because you couldn't tell my boo-boos when I did it. Because I'm not a painter, but I had fun doing it. What a cute kitty face. Really cute. So you'll see this again, too. Yep. I think I have swallowed um, at least a cup of fur today for some reason. We've been, we've been doing a lot of brushing on the cats, and Judy S. was here today, and she brushed a lot, too. Oh, um, I think we need to pull, yeah, a little too close for Coral Lee. Oh, and then Ann was combing a couple of the porchies. Oh, we had a couple young girls here today. You want to put it somewhere? Um, on the counter in the storeroom. We had a couple young girls here today. Very nice young girls. Oh. And uh, they were here for a couple hours of service work. And so we sent them out to uh, port, um, the house that Jonah built. And they cleaned and cleaned and cleaned. The dangerous one. Or I can do it. Oh. Um, so they did they did a lot of cleaning and then they went back when they were done and um brushed out some of the coldies. This is from Eagle Watcher Bath Bath Bath. We cut, this is a cat suitical after surgery. Oh, recovery suit, extra extra small. Hey Beth. Oh my gosh, and it's camel. <laughs> <laughs> Oh. Freedom to eat and drink allows use of litter box, retains ability to move, easy to use. And I think I might know what Beth is thinking about. Is our um, the bar is closed? Hey Beth, this is actually really really. I think this would work. And you know what, Beth? The sock is working pretty good for. Chloe, I told her today we gotta take that off, girl, and um uh wash it, but I don't have anything for Poppy, so because they can't reach any faucets on uh Chloe, they've been swarming Poppy. And I absolutely do not have a sock to fit her. I think this would fit fit Poppy. Oh hey, and this Beth, this I think this this will do the trick. Well, it's 
not really like a thunder shirt tiger cat because you know how those wrap around the belly and you kind of have to fold that thing under and wrap that around this is just something we can slide right over stick the feet in this is very similar design to what we did with the sock but it doesn't have any holes in it that's we'll try this yeah I'll do it in the morning so I can watch but I'm, I'm betting this will be perfect we need to keep this so we can maybe have to get another one for futures yeah that's perfect 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 I'll stick it in there and then I'll see it in the morning you know that's one of my favorites for this oh yeah this one is also from Beth oh thank you Beth these are for um, the people that works outside or going outside for a while um, like Anthony and Angie too these are those it has been really hot and they're saying that July is going to be very hot and um, dry and these are those cooling scarves yet yeah, I don't think you need one cool scarf Beth I, I will make sure that they, uh, Anthony and Angie gets theirs and then Barb, Barb's <laughs> looking like I could use one too yeah yeah Chloe and we do get it off too and Chloe's Saki and let her groom thank yeah. you Beth yeah thank you Beth um, are you grabbing Barb hey Barb yeah. I'm gonna put a few of these in the right side drawer for for you and whoever to use and then I'll put some back I'll put a couple back there for Anthony and Candy too yeah okay thanks thank you I know I, I got it I got it Jack Hat I just got this one first but I have it I promise I'd be careful. Yep. We'll put those out. Um, can you put the, um, you know what, just so I don't forget to do what I'm supposed to do. Sometimes I stick stuff up there and then when I do breakfast, I remember it. Where do I put this shot? That goes in the um, wagon out there and we'll burn. Oh, it's empty. It's empty. Yeah. Oh, okay. And this is from Faithy. Guess what it is? Do Rachel's most favorite snack in the world. The CET Chewies. I was just talking about these to someone today. Oh, I was talking to just me about these. Yep. And look what arrived. These are the Rachel's favorite, favorite, favorite. And so what we do is we toss out like a half a bag at a time. Zelda, uh, Zelda uh, Faithy sends these. These are from Faithy, and she usually sends four, so we have one a month, one a week. And I try to do it like twice a week, but use half a bag at a time. And uh, they, there's a lot of them that really like these, but whatever's left or pieces of what's left, the Rachel goes around and. And these big crummy messes. These are uh, oral hygiene chews, fish flavor. They're um, from from uh, you can get them at your vet's office. There's 30 in each one of these. They have like a little peroxide in them, and they it helps to keep the gums clean. Yeah, gums, gums, gums. C E T oral hygiene rinse. So these are, yeah, these are good. All right, you stay there. I don't want you to go backwards, baby. Okay. We always know when we have those that we're going to have a big mess on the floor from DeRacho. 
Okay, girl. She's just the cutest fox cat ever. Oh, oops, oops. Scared Sarah. Yeah, she closed the door and said, uh, There you go. Like, half in it. If anybody sees uh, Hensley, he needs his TV too tonight. He was here just a minute ago. There he is, just like over there down there. Okay, yeah. I'll put it in my pocket. Let's see if Sarah heard up. Be careful. There you go. Good girl. Yeah. Okay. All right, so we're going to keep on putting you down here. See my, oh, no, no. And this one, there you go. Um, this is a Nassau Hobby Center. Nassau, I don't have a name on it. This is what somebody emailed me about. Um, here, we'll turn it over. There we go. Wow. And I have, I need a refresher on. Who sent this to me? I just, uh, my mind is like, I'm not sure. But I, so I need a refresher on who sent this. It's the Pet Shop Diesel Ready to Run Lion Chef set. It has a remote control. It's the Pet Shop Diesel. Awesome, awesome, awesome box. Um, ready to run wall pack terminal. Wall pack power supply, seven curved fast tracks, a remote control with it. It go. It's uh, the layout is 40 by 40. Everything in it it has to do with animals, like animal care supply car. Each of the cars has something animal related, and I know there's animals in here. It's an electric train. Whoa. Jocelyn, I have paper for you to draw on when I come on Friday. And yay, Mary's coming. No, this is going to be for a raffle. This will be a raffle. So, look at that. I bet you cats would like it. Yeah, I bet so, Robot Man. Pet Shop Diesel. Everything on it has to do with pets. Okay, folks, you will see this again. Remote control system. What do you think about this, Jossie? Do you know about this? Have you seen these? Yeah, they're pretty cool. It has Jocelyn's approval. Yeah. Anani, anonymous 393, we need you to sign in, please. All right. Yeah, Mudgy. Yeah. Okay. Um, I'm gonna. I put like electric and electronic stuff upstairs. Now I've done that, right? Yes, those are all there. Okay. And this. And okay. Wow. Whoops. We have this. And we have these. Wow. Yeah, I bet kitties would would like to do that. Oh yeah, hey Jossie, can I share a can I trade you? You take one and I'll take one. Oh gosh. So we got some catching up to do here. Um we had an anonymous donor. 
Margie is the anonymous a donor, a donor uh, donated a bunch of cheap tapes, so I thank you for that. We turn those in, you know, Bill does that for us. He adds them all up, and uh, we turn them in a couple times a year, and we get a few hundred dollars from that, so that's pretty cool. Kitties would knock it off the track all the time, but I bet they had fun, didn't they, Mudgy? <laughs> After tomorrow is my day of celebration because after tomorrow, Steve's back at full capacity. He has to start carrying things and lifting things up. <laughs> no more slacking off for him. <laughs> okay, this is a donation from Susan C. Susan, thank you, thank you, thank you. Uh oh, did somebody get hurt? She just missed it, though. Okay. Um, a Jim, this is from James H. from Ohio, uh, made a donation to the Rescue Center. James has been a part of the Rescue Center for a long time. Yeah. James H. from Toledo. And Clark. Hey, Clark. And Jesse and Gang, we've been giving your adoption um, blankies out. This says, Happy Birthday. LC. 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 Oh, LC. You mean LC? LC. God wanted to brighten up the world. So he made you. Happy first Jesse birthday, LC. Clark, Jesse, and the rest of the gang. And her birthday was June 27th. And we have the chicken $5. And I'm. I've got a big note in my purse. Cat chicken. We gotta get cat chicken. Beth was kind enough to get some last week for the kitties because we were out. Um, Courtney T. from Maine uh, sent in a donation and Courtney is our, our uh, lady that came here a few years ago and adopted Calico kitties. Remember her? She's got the Calico clan. And every once in a while I get a picture of them and they're just all beautiful. Beautiful. Uh, Neil. Neil. Uh, we got your donation. Thank you, Neil. Appreciate you. You have such an awesome family. Love your daughter and grandkids. This is from Craig M. And family from Michigan. We did also receive your donation. A lot of these were like the contributions, um, just an assortment. And because we were in, last week, we were in the week after Catathon, we did open up a lot of the envelopes because um, if they were Catathon related and it was for a basket or big ticket or something item, we wanted to uh, get that out that same very day. And I knew we were going to have a few days without opening envelopes. So we did do that. We rarely pre-open them. Um, Claire, Claire A. from California, we opened yours and you had an order from Paul Mart and I believe it's already on the way to you too. This is from Rose SF6, sending a big hug and this was also for uh, a contribution. Just to let you know I care. Enclosed is my contribution check for 2016 Catathon. It was fun to watch. And her kitties are Marble, Blackie, Marble, Blackie, Fluffy, Brownie, and Checkers. And she says, get this, the you at Cat Stock. Cat Stock. Oops, wait, which way am I going? Those ones already did. That I already did. This one I already did, right? No. Nope. Nope. That one you nope. did. We're going this way. And this is from Rosanna G. from California. We received your order um, for Palmart, and your item is also on the way to you. Bill and Mary C. Mary, we, we received yours from Minnesota, and you had basket 142, and it's on the way. Mary K. Minnesota, we received yours. Um, you had the, I think the Laurel Birch. I am grateful for those who have donated, 
um, the items and those who will pack and ship it. Oh, FFRC brings us together in peace, laughter, and community, and tears, and laughter again. God bless us each and every one. Froggy touched my heart. I enjoy watching Polly, Vivian, Elsie, and Rachel. The kitties are lively. Oh. And she sent a picture of Josie and um, I think it was Mayo, Josie and Mayo, uh, her, her kitty cats. Thank you for that, Mary. Appreciate that. <laughs> um, Victoria S. from California, we received your envelope for Catathon. No, Faithy. Thank you for all that you do, Victoria and her two kitties. No, the person, whoever, I'm, we're not exactly sure what happened because somehow or another we didn't get a name down for the uh, the memorial, never forgotten um, plaque. So we actually still have that here. Uh, Terry W., we received your... Um, <laughs> we received your uh, check too, and her picture looks like Tabitha. It was for 280, Faithy. Joyce A from California, you got the wind chimes, and I know that that is already on the way. I found your Ustream site when I was looking for a cat rescue for an 11-year-old cat that belonged to a friend who passed. The vet told me that due to its age, Tanner would be hard to place in another home. Because a, a member of my household had allergies, the cat could not remain here. When I looked at the various cat rescue centers, I decided yours was the one and I, and, and I wanted to take Tanner to. I was just ready to call you and hopefully you would have accepted Tanner and I would have driven Tanner from California to Ohio. However, with the help of the local cat coalition, I was able to locate Tanner into the home of an elderly lady who had just lost her home. Since then, I have looked at your Ustream site and on occasion I have read comments by your chatters. I know who likes bacon and who does not, lol. I'm greatly impressed by your commitment as well as those of your volunteers. I enjoy watching the cats. Enjoy Catathon. And also voting. Thank you so much, Joyce. And uh, Jennifer and Hannah, our two friends, of course, from Indiana. We received yours, and I know your baskets are on their way to you, too. Might have already had them. <laughs> We can be friends. Goodness gracious, and share. <laughs> Priscilla O, uh, we received yours. Yours was Big Ticket 219. Jim and Robin S. from Florida, your basket uh, check was received and already sent out. And uh, O, Farm Girl, Jan, um, we received your donation. And Jan, is uh, foster is, is fostering three little bottle fed kittens right now, and I'm totally worn out. <clears throat> she sent me another email too that uh, it sounds like she had three has three of them. One of them was really teeny tiny, but they're all three doing really well. And I told Jan that's because she's a very very good foster mommy. Hey, can I open this? Uh, can I open this one? Oh, this is FFRC, the best ever. From came from Georgia. First name starts with K. Here we go. Oh my gosh! Every stitch done with love for you, Jackie, and what you do for the kitties. Love all of you. K, K A Y, K T from Georgia. 
Oh my gosh. This is my daughter Dawn and me. The, uh, you know, my brother-in-law, um, um, I can't even talk, makes frames for things. I will send this. I will send this with um, Judy and ask her to have Dave frame it for me. Listen, there's 48 colors in this. And there's 15,680 stitches in this. That's amazing. I mean, it looks like a photograph. I cannot believe that. I don't even know. Okay, K E Y K T from Georgia. Going to that Wow. No, she doesn't say. Yeah, me too. I don't like it. I wasn't very good at it. It takes my breath away. Holy cow is right. She whiz. Oh my gosh. I got to Take a picture and I'll send it to Dawn right now. Wow. I'll put from um, K from Georgia. I'm not even spelling right. Fifteen thousand six hundred and eighty stitches. I'd love to know. Kay, if you're on, we'd love to know how long this took. Oh, a fiddle. My thing isn't working right. 15,600. And <laughs> my thing is backwards on this for some reason. 48 colors. I don't have any idea how you did this, Kay. That's my girl. Look at the back on this. I'm just totally shocked and impressed. Look at the back, what all the stitches. Can you see all the different things being wind and twined and... Wow, I'll have this frame. Thank you, Kay. This is just gorgeous. This is a real treasure. Yeah, 15,680 stitches in 48 colors. That is amazing, Nance. Wow. Yeah, wow. Thank you, Kay. I will... Um, See about Dave put, making a frame for this for me. Wow, and a whole lot of love. Oh, wait till Dawn sees that. I, she should be home from hospice by now. Could you do me a favor? Would you put this on my bed? I can. My house scares me right now, but on my bed I will not leave it. Thank you, Kay. Appreciate that. Here's Kenzie. There he is. Hey, Kathy. I got his pill. Do you like it in there? Yeah, she's been here since I got in there. <laughs> and oh. And a couple of kitties had to pass in there while I got that. So, I know. The puggy's name is Joy. Joy, Joy. Joy, Joy June. I call her Joy. June a lot. Oh, he's such a good boy. Oh, wow. Oh, and I have some other thank yous, too, here. Maji, if you're still on, could you help me with these? Um, we've had some visitors. Kurzweil and Tom. Goldfish. 
two bottles of Tide and two Mr. Clean. So, thank you. Thank you, Ann. Mm -hmm. And, uh, kind of thanks again for supper. Yeah. You know, Steve's going to turn around. He's, he's, you want to hear a joke, or did I tell you guys this already? Steve and I have saved, it's been 21 years we've been saving to redo, and you know we already did the bathroom in the back room, and we've been working on the kitchen. It's taken us a long time, but we're finally, finally getting to do it. Yeah, a box of goldfish crackers. So, I told Steve a couple of days ago when the kitchen was done that maybe I would start cooking again. And then I looked at him and said, no, it's his kitchen. <laughs> Gladly give it to, to Steve. Uh, some input. <laughs> yeah, he did. He had some input on it. Yeah. Uh, one of the right pieces of equipment are there. I don't care where it's at. Right. One is there. <laughs> okay. All right.